Hey guys, my fantastic Invicare of my own, uh, smaller size wheelchair. Let's go through it. So guys, this is a more petite chair. Um, you know, I can see a, um, a smaller adult, uh, you know, or a younger occupant, like maybe a middle, uh, a pre-adolescent child, or maybe a small teenager using this chair. Uh, we'll talk about the measurements and the features, but it's an attractive unit. If you have a need for one, well, you know. So, first of all, it's got this attractive color scheme, and that's just, you know, you can get the minds of different colors. And I mean, let's face it, if you um, ha are having to use a chair, having one that's as nice as possible is a nice touch. Uh, nice foot pedals in the front, which are, of course, fold up as they should. And, of course, they're removable to put in your vehicle. Nice um, uh, non-sore-inducing uh, cushion. Uh, that's a part of, it's actually built right into the unit. So, sometimes you have wheelchairs that are... Um, it'll, it'll be uh, removable. This one is actually fixed in place. Now you could do a little effort like this. Is, this has got a velcro on it. This is a pris prism ideal cushion, but um, yeah, that's how that works. Um, this is a fixed chair. And again, if you uh, check around, you'll find that those who have to use chairs all the time, they prefer fixed chairs because a folding chair simply is not as stable and uh, the user experience is lacking. 17 inches from side to side between the handlebars there. Uh, 19 inches deep and it's also 17 inches high from the floor to the base of the seat. Uh, tires and wheels are in great shape. They're 20 inches and the brakes function the way they should. These uh, handlebars are adjustable and again you use an Allen key just to do so as is the backrest here and you can adjust the height up and down and the pitch and again you can see that these are all directions that you can um, or things you can do when you when you get the wheelchair for your particular person. And again, let's face it, when you buy one brand new for the very large money they charge for wheelchairs, they do those kinds of fitments for you. But again, it's questionable if that's worth it because again, we all know how much um, you get hosed for when you have to buy one of these chairs brand new. But the Mayan is a, is a top quality chair. It's very lightweight, uh, which your user is going to appreciate. And as far as the other carriers, that's a scissor mechanism underneath. Um, if you were to remove this bar here, you could make it a folding chair. But, um, you know, again, those who know would appreciate having a chair like this um, as a fixed chair. There's also the um, retainer bars in the back to keep it from uh, flipping when, you, uh, do your, when you're when you moving it around. And, of course, there's a nice seat belt, which is adjustable. I'm going to take some photos. be higher quality in this video. Make sure, you review, make sure you review them. But it's a great chair you'll be pleased to own. As far as pricing is concerned, pricing is firm. Um, you can tell by the quality of the sad. I do this all the time. We sell a lot of um, health care aids and, uh, you know, it's not my business, but this came out of a nice, handsome estate and uh, which simply wasn't needed. And so uh, it's coming to market in super clean shape, ready to be used. And so as a result, you know, you don't have any excuses to deal with. So pricing is firm and fair. I simply will not have conversations about price. So please bear that in mind when you do reach out. But that being said, it is very reasonably priced in the marketplace. Um, when you reach out, you'll find it will get it together the time that works really well for you. It seats exactly as I've described, and there'll be no funny business about it. So show me that, guys. If you like what you see, send me a text, email, phone call, and I'll sell it to you.